As the great Arthur C. Clarke once said, any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. Imagine with a device you carry around in your pocket, you can pinpoint your location anywhere on the planet. This is the magic of GPS or global positioning system. It's become such an integral part of our everyday lives, helping us navigate from point A to point B, tracking our fitness routines, even guiding airplanes and ships across vast oceans. This video series brought to you by Earthbyte is here to unravel the mystery behind this magical technology. We'll delve into how GPS works, its history, and its profound impact on our lives. So if you're fascinated by this blend of science and sorcery, make sure to subscribe to Earthbyte. You wouldn't want to miss out on this journey of discovery, would you? Navigating through life has never been easier thanks to GPS. Have you ever wondered what GPS is and how it works? Let's dive into it. GPS, or Global Positioning System, is a marvel of technology that has transformed the way we navigate our world. It's a system of 24 satellites, and a few extras for good measure, that are continuously orbiting our planet, transmitting precise time and positional data back to Earth. The concept of GPS is relatively straightforward. These satellites send out a signal, and your GPS receiver, whether it's in your car, your phone, or a standalone device, picks up these signals. By calculating the time it took for the signal to arrive, the receiver can figure out how far away each satellite is. Now imagine you're in a vast field with no distinctive landmarks. A friend is calling out to you from somewhere in that field. By just hearing their voice, it's hard to pinpoint their exact location. But if you had three friends calling out, you could use the sound of their voices and how long it took for their call to reach you to triangulate their positions relative to you. That's essentially what your GPS receiver does, but instead of voices, it's using the signals from at least four satellites. Why four and not three like in our example? The fourth one is used to correct any time discrepancies and provide more accurate data as time is a crucial factor in this process. So, GPS is not just about finding the fastest route to your favorite restaurant. It's a complex system that involves high-speed satellites, precision timing, and some clever mathematics. It's also used for a myriad of applications, far beyond just navigation. Think about emergency services being able to locate a distressed caller, or geologists tracking continental drift, or farmers ensuring they plant their crops in perfectly straight lines. So in essence, GPS is a system that helps us know exactly where we are on this vast planet. It's a system that has revolutionized navigation and timing and continues to be an integral part of our daily lives. The creation of GPS was no overnight success. It's a result of brilliant minds and decades of hard work. The journey of GPS, or Global Positioning System, begins in the mid-20th century during the Cold War era. The United States Department of Defense, or DOD, played a pivotal role in its inception. The initial purpose of GPS was to provide the military with a reliable method for precise navigation. The idea of GPS was sparked by the launch of the Soviet Union's Sputnik, the world's first artificial satellite in 1957. American scientists realized they could pinpoint the satellite's location by tracking the Doppler effect changes of its radio signals. This discovery laid the groundwork for the development of GPS. In the early 60s, a team of researchers at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, led by Dr. Ivan Getting and Professor Bradford Parkinson, began working on the concept of GPS. The team proposed using a constellation of satellites to provide navigation data to receivers on the ground. This concept was tested and refined throughout the 60s and 70s, the first GPS satellite, known as NAVSTAR, was launched by the DoD in 1978. Over the next 15 years, a total of 24 satellites were launched into orbit, providing global coverage. In 1993, the system was declared fully operational. Dr. Gladys West, a mathematician at the Naval Surface Warfare Center, also made significant contributions to the development of GPS. She developed and implemented complex algorithms to model the shape of the Earth, a critical component of accurate GPS calculations. The GPS was initially reserved for military use, but was gradually made available for civilian use in the late 80s. Following the tragic Korean Airlines Flight 7 incident in 1983, President Ronald Reagan announced that GPS would be freely available to the public once it was fully operational. From its inception as a military tool, GPS has evolved into a global utility, 
transforming the way we navigate and perceive our world. Today, it's an integral part of our daily lives, powering everything from navigation apps on our smartphones to precision farming. From a military tool to a global utility, the journey of GPS is truly remarkable. Now that we know what GPS is and its history, let's delve into its workings. At its core, GPS, or Global Positioning System, is a network of satellites, ground stations, and receivers. It's like a high-tech game of Marco Polo taking place in the vast expanse of space. But instead of shouting Marco and Polo, we're dealing with signals being sent and received at the speed of light. The system is composed of around 30 satellites orbiting the Earth at a height of about 20,000 kilometers. These satellites are constantly on the move, completing two full orbits every single day. Each one of these satellites is equipped with an atomic clock, which is incredibly precise, only losing or gaining a second every 30,000 years. These satellites send out signals containing their location and the exact time the signal was transmitted, based on their onboard atomic clock. These signals then travel at light speed to reach the GPS receivers on Earth. Now let's talk about these receivers. They could be in your smartphones, cars, watches, or even in that drone you've been flying around. These receivers pick up the signals from the satellites, but due to the time it takes for the signal to reach the receiver, there's a slight delay. This delay is where the magic happens. The receiver also knows the exact time the signal was sent thanks to the information in the signal itself. By comparing the time the signal was sent to the time it was received, the GPS can calculate how far away the satellite is. Now, knowing the distance to one satellite might not seem that helpful. And you'd be right. To pinpoint your exact location, you need data from at least four satellites. This is where the concept of triangulation comes into play. By knowing the distance to at least four satellites, the GPS receiver can figure out exactly where you are. Picture it like this. Each satellite you're in contact with creates a sphere with you at the center. Where these spheres overlap is your exact position, but there's more. The reason we need at least four satellites is because of something called clock bias. The clocks in GPS receivers aren't as precise as the atomic clocks in the satellites. This slight discrepancy can lead to errors in calculating the distance. The fourth satellite helps correct this error, ensuring that the GPS can pinpoint your location with incredible precision. This is the simplified version of how GPS works. There are other factors at play, like the Earth's atmosphere slowing down the signal, but the satellites and receivers account for these and correct any possible errors. And that's how GPS pinpoints your location with incredible precision anywhere in the world. The impact of GPS goes beyond just helping us reach our destinations. It's a silent, pervasive force that has permeated nearly every facet of our lives. From the moment you check your smartphone in the morning to the tracking of goods shipped globally, GPS is there, quietly shaping our world. In navigation, GPS has revolutionized how we travel, making paper maps almost obsolete. But that's just the tip of the iceberg. In disaster relief, GPS technology assists in coordinating rescue efforts, helping save countless lives. In the scientific realm, it aids in tracking climate change and monitoring wildlife migration patterns. But it doesn't stop there. GPS has also transformed industries, from agriculture, where it aids in precision farming, to logistics, where it streamlines supply chain management. Even in the world of finance, GPS timestamps are used to prevent fraudulent transactions. Indeed, GPS is a silent force that drives our world in ways we often overlook. From guiding us home to aiding in scientific research, GPS has truly made our world smaller and our lives easier. We've journeyed together through the intricate workings of GPS, from its humble beginnings to the vast network of satellites that encircle our planet today. We've delved into the complex mathematics and science that enable this technological marvel to pinpoint our location anywhere on Earth. We've recognized the brilliant minds who pioneered this system, opening up a world of possibilities from navigation to weather prediction and even aiding scientific research. The impact of GPS on our lives is undeniable. It has transformed how we navigate our world, conduct business, and even how we interact with each other. As we continue to explore the digital frontier, GPS stands as a testament to human ingenuity and our relentless quest for knowledge. Remember to subscribe to EarthBite for more enlightening videos like this one. Share this video with your friends and help us spread the knowledge.